obviously this is an inserted clip. I wanted to save this before the video started so you're not confused. What you're about to see is the final result of my new and improved updated makeup routine. If y'all want a video on that, I will make a separate one. Um, I was getting ready to attend the Zeta Phi Beta Gamma Nu Chapters 75th um, chapter anniversary um, in support of one of my favorite Zeta and finer women. Um, so that's what you're about to see here. The environment was so dope. The aquarium, I just feel like a little kid again, honestly. Um, so yeah, roll through with the vlog. <laughs> hey y'all, get ready with me to go to this gala. It is, hold on. It is 6.20 right now. The gala starts at 7. I'm going to be a little bit late, but we got to get our makeup done. So let's get into it. So what I like to do first whenever I do my makeup now, um, I'm not going to lie. I try to stay away from primer. I really, really do. I ain't going to lie to you. I don't know where my primer is. So we're just going to go in to hydrate the face with a little bit of Mario Badescu. This is not the lavender one. This is the rose water spray. I don't have any more lavender, but look at the glow that I got already. I'm going to let this dry down and then I'm going to come back. I think it's hella funny that every time I'm about to go out somewhere and get cute, my grandma always got some smart ass shit to say. Like, girl, please, not today. This might sound crazy, but I'm going in with my J roller. I already have hydrated and moisturized my face earlier when I uh did my face. But what I really, really want is the J roller to depuff my face. And I want it to like also sculpt it too. So yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. Does this rain have anybody else sleepy? Because I promise you, if I didn't get up like 20 minutes ago, I would be knocked out right now. Before we do our makeup, it's only right that I take a shot because I need to wake myself up. Bust the bottom. Cheers. That's enough. I love that they're big one with this Hydro Grip Primer. I'm obsessed. My makeup will never ever move. And we're going to, I'm going to show y'all. I know I can't be the only person that is literally fed up and tired of school like I just want my degree and that is all I gotta let this dry down but honey I'm it's a skin for me I did such a good job of you know maintaining my skin this week I shaved my face earlier in the week I'm just obsessed with the with the skin okay the government is trying to ban TikTok and yet what about our gun control like, America is really a friendly-ass bitch, and I really, really hate that. Not only is America broke, but you're friendly as well. You can't be broke and friendly. This looks crazy. Just trust the process. These two right here, the holy grail. I am obsessed with my makeup and I'm not even done yet. If you don't know what I'm talking about, it's a Dior Forever Skin Glow. I'm the shade 45, 4, 4, 5 and neutral. And then in the Born This Way Concealer, I am the shade Honey. I'm going to let my powder sit under my eye and apply this YSL mascara. I've literally worn this like... Maybe on the count on my hands, probably like five times. I like it. It's just, I need to stop buying shit. Going in with Morphe because I love Morphe. Yeah. This beauty mark, well, up here was accident. That's because of my mascara. I think I'm going to get rid of the one right here because I don't like it. I look, I feel like it looks mad apparent and done on purpose. Whether this looks just flawless. Yeah. Cause it's given. Let's put on these lashes. Since 
my lashes are not cooperating. We're going to go in with the Kiss X Meredith Duxbury um, lashes in the Angel Eyes. Because I need a good wisp always. These are a bit more on the natural side, but I'm not mad at it. I ate this beat up. Let me refresh this gloss and let's get the hell on the road. This gloss is by Brina's Beauty, one of my favorite girls and supporters from YouTube. Make sure I go shop her business because it's black owned and this gloss, top 10. <laughs> It's so pretty out here. Hey y'all, so I am standing outside of the Camden Aquarium. I had the luxury to be a part of the 75, 75th annual Gamma, is a Gamma News Day the chapter? of the Zeta Phi Beta Incorporated, Sorority Incorporated, excuse me. Um, I would say Miss Greer is a coworker of mine, but that's really like my dog. Um, she just crossed grad chapter last year. So I was here celebrating her looking like a baddie. Um, it's the makeup for me. Elf Primer, you snapped and did your big one with that one. But um, yeah, I'm waiting on the Uber to go home and I'm pretty good drunk, I ain't gonna lie. Bye. Get ready with me to have a productive ass day. Y'all, why the fuck is it raining and it's sunny out? I can't show y'all because that's mad federal, but I just think that's mad crazy. My teeth white as hell, Y'all already know it's beauty bakery on the lips, come on. If you not, using a lip mask at this point in life are you really doing this skincare shit right due to me having anxiety and being diagnosed with having anxiety by my doctor um she suggested that you know i start to make task lists for myself which i already have done um and she recommended me to take lexapro not gonna lie to you i'm not taking that medication i don't like man made meds if you know you know um I just am, I'm just a firm believer that I'm a little lazy when it comes to my anxiety and I don't think medication is going to help but as long as I'm in the right headspace your girl's going to be fine and don't get me wrong I love my doctor that's my home girly girl but I really just don't believe in taking medication when it comes to dealing with mental illness and that's just me personally if you have tried Lexapro or any other anxiety meds, comment down below and let me know how it is for you and what's it like because with me knowing that I actively have anxiety, I've decided to, you know, try to get more active on campus at Rowan. Um, even though I stay off campus, y'all see the sun, it's getting brighter. But I signed up for um, Getting Unstuck, which is a depression workshop. And then I signed up for an anxiety um anxiety workshop 
And I had my first session this morning. And I ain't gonna lie, that shit gave me anxiety. Like, girl, what do you mean turn on my camera? Baby, I got on a pink bonnet. I look crazy. I look like the Muffin Man at this time. You want me to put my camera on? The crazy part is, I was literally the first person there. And was literally the only person there for like the first 10 minutes. Until another girl had joined us. It was supposed to be like six of us. But essentially, until I could find a therapist. Um, because my, de my dentist. What the fuck? My doctor recommended that I go back to therapy. Which, I don't know if y'all knew already. I've been wanting to go back. Um... I just can't go back at Rowan at this time, um, which I ain't going to lie. I'm going to try to see if I can go back to Rowan to get some counseling again because these therapists, baby, is not accepting your girl's insurance. And I really hate that. So, yeah, these workshops are going to get your girl, you know, together, hopefully, praying. But I'm not going to lie. I love that they can with packets for each, like, workshop. Um, they're, like, a couple... They're like four weeks long and it's like a session every week, I believe, for the next three or four weeks. So I'm excited to actively participate and get my mental right because I got I got ish to do. The Organic Skincare Co. has a lot of good skincare, but this baby specifically the clean slate, the clean slate cleanser with fruit acid complex really, really helps like Get the grime off your face after you do your makeup. Girl, I had my makeup done the other day. And let me show y'all in case y'all didn't see. Y'all, y'all, hey, hey, down. Stop playing with that girl because she's not one of them. You can't see her and tell me that I didn't beat this face. I beat the fuck out of my face, okay? Oh, I can't wait to do a tutorial. Anyways, you want to get your makeup off? Use this. My best friend, well, one of my best friends is in school to become a lawyer. And that thread of like what people nowadays would say if they were lawyers, like it's the road for me or um, your honor, my client wouldn't even partake in those types of festivities, bro. That whole thread had me crying and I had to send it to her because knowing her Southern ass, that's probably going to be her. Check on your strong friends and be appreciative of the friends that you have. Ever since I decided to take a step back instead of making newer friendships, I've been focusing on the friendships that I've already... I've been locked in with these people for 10 plus years. So, like, ever since I started to focus on my inner circle, I feel like I found my strength in them. And our relationships individually um, are getting 10 times better. And I freaking love that for me. You can never forget the SPF. And I just... Child, I'm ready to be outside. I feel like I have been in the house all year for the past year, and I'm sick of it. The only thing that I have been consistently doing is school, and I'm over that. I really hate having those piercings because shit like this be happening, and I'd be ready to rip this shit out my damn nose. I got content to make, so I love y'all. <sighs> What a great day to be a hoe. It just smells like switch them up. That's what it smells like. Switch them up. Let's hear what you got. All right. These lips. Wrap it up. Y'all, another inserted clip again. Um, y'all didn't tell me that when your battery dies on your camera that you lose all your footage. I literally had like two or three extra clips for this vlog. And when I downloaded them from my SD card reader, they didn't pop up. Um, I even switched my battery and they're still not on this card at all. Like I never recorded it. But basically, um, I had a makeup class last week and, um, <clears throat> it, just everything was just, everything last week was just going wrong so it got rescheduled uh for this upcoming week you'll see that in a new vlog um what else happened i also had a doctor's appointment and um basically i needed to get the proper um documentation to send to my school so i could i could get uh accommodations to, uh in regards to my schoolwork for me now being diagnosed with anxiety yes your girl has been diagnosed but with anxiety um officially for 
almost a month now um it's really not hard i mean not hard it's really not easy um it's actually pretty fucking hard uh definitely stressful because i have my moods um i also think i got seasonal depression but we're not here to talk about that um <laughs> um what else is tea i'm not studying abroad um it just was too expensive and i could not see myself investing that kind of money into just one trip yes the memories would have been great yes the experience would have been nice but um they do it like every year so i'm definitely going to try again next year um i just wanted to be smart with my money and um get my life together like i have not been doing school anything school related for like the past two months i'm just now really starting to get back into the habit of doing so um thank god my doctor's note uh excused me and allowed me to make up the work that i need to make up so your girl can pass and get off of academic probation um it's given it's not given 4.0 but it's definitely giving a three point i i de i definitely better have a fucking 3.0 by the time the semester ends um we have like eight weeks left in the semester well not even honestly i have a month left because my last class ends may 8th um and i do got a surprise for y'all but y'all know how i am i don't like to announce anything until it's done um yeah y'all i'm i'm finna shock y'all with this one um <laughs> It's just a lot going on. I really just need to sit down and talk to y'all for real so y'all can get the real. Um, that honestly just might be my next vlog after this one because I feel like so much has happened and so much has transpired um, in the past two weeks. Hell, all of last month, really, and I didn't really get a chance to too much touch on it. So I'm going to do that. I'm sorry that the clips got deleted. I was not aware that the clips got deleted. Um, I'm literally editing this as we speak and there are no clips. So... I apologize. Um, everything that has been mentioned in this vlog, though, will be in the description box. Support your girl, okay? Like, I'm really trying to master this affiliate marketing-ish. So, if your girl, if y'all could help your girl out, that would be lovely. Um, yeah, back to the vlog. I was wondering why this shit was so damn expensive for $32. That's because I got the biggest damn one that they probably got on Amazon. I've already tried El Glutamine before, but I haven't been consistent with it, so I'm going to start. But I want you guys to join in with me for a challenge for the month of April, starting April 1st. I'm going to do the challenge and tackle taking El Glutamine for an entire month. I'm going to record my results, track my progress, keep y'all updated, all of that. But yeah, go get you some because, honey, get you some. Hey, y'all. <laughs> I'm so sorry that this vlog is going like this, but there's nothing I can do about it at this point. Um, so in the previous clip, y'all saw me talking about the El Gudami. It's April now. I started the challenge and I kid y'all not, that video was not going viral. It wasn't doing nothing. I think the most views it had was like 5K. I'm cool with that. Y'all, it literally started to like pick up the other night randomly, like out of nowhere. And then another video I stitched, went crazy out of nowhere um thank y'all so much for the love and support on tiktok i know that that is my biggest platform and i try to utilize that to make everybody go everywhere especially over here on youtube because y'all are my babies i i built this platform first so it's it was very overwhelming um i'm hosting a class and i think i said that in the next clip after this um you're gonna see i'm gonna explain um I'm so grateful that my engagement picked up, my following picked up. We getting 400k by the end of this week. I don't know how the fuck I'm finna do it, but it's already done and it's getting done. Amen. All right. Hey, y'all. Um, <laughs> I'm fried as fuck. I don't know where I left off last or when I where I picked the camera up. Um, child, we gonna end this vlog here because it's a new week now and. I got some other content that I want to push out for y'all. So, I'm going to see y'all all in the next vlog. I love y'all so much. Thank y'all so much for having me go viral. Um, My little trick worked. I will be having a class on it. So, stay tuned for the next video about what my class is on. Because, baby, I'm really, I'm really, <laughs> I'm really like that with this TikTok shit. 
um my follower count finally going up we hit 400k by the end of this week though i'm not fucking playing we got till next sunday so i love y'all and i'm gonna see y'all in the next vlog